Sue Coach. All right, I'm proud to introduce Linda Joseph. She began her career in graduate school focusing on interior architectural design and photography. And for many years, she lived her dream, fulfilling her passion while teaching and doing uh, and photographing nature and wildlife to both uh, children and adults. Her venues include Cerritos College, Palos Verdes Art Center, El Dorado Nature Center, and Yellowstone and Glacier Institutes. Her images were represented in seven galleries in two states. Her focus changed through necessity, and for 10 years she worked for other companies, continuing to do photography and design on the side. Two and a half years ago, she gravitated to commercial event and product photography. Linda's best friend and the love of her life is her husband, Phil. She's been married six months, 15 days, and 19 and a half hours. <laughs> but who's counting? Moi. <laughs> her burning desire is to be able to live in a teaching ranch complete with bunkhouses in Trinidad, Colorado, where adults, kids, and underprivileged city kids get a chance to explore nature and wildlife photography, astronomy, and themselves. She taught mountaineering for nine years and loves gardening, nature, and, of course, photography. So let's give it up for Linda. for photography took root in the second grade as I watched nature films. Each one swept me away, magically mesmerizing and enticing me into the wild scene. Time stood still. As the oldest of seven children, I saw myself as responsible and often asked to use my mom's brownie camera. With few exceptions, the answer was always no. We know that one. In the seventh grade, I finally bought my very first camera, a Polaroid swing camera, with the babysitting money I earned. That summer, we took a vacation to Grandpa's farm in Oklahoma where I photographed my family and the farmhouse. I held my breath for nearly three minutes as the image of the farmhouse developed before my eyes. I could barely wait to pull the backing off of it. Here in my hand was the picture of the farmhouse with dappling light from the overhanging trees. That scene, that landscape, was the most beautiful black and white image I had ever seen. I was captivated by the light and, and the magic. I was hooked. Photography had seduced me, and there went the baby scene. <laughs> Enjoy. and product photography that I'm showing you today. Some of it was from Fixtures Living. Thank you, Audra. 